right, I can't wait to show you the house. They've made so much progress and I wanna give you a quick tour. Hang on. All right, there she is. She looks amazing. I'm gonna cross the street here. There's been a lot of traffic coming by, but uh, you have your lead block coming up to your house. You have your uh, driveway installed. You got guys working right now in the plumbing but we're, we'll take a quick tour in there and let you kind of check out what's going on. The house next door has a slab poured and then the house on the right is being framed out. So by the time you move in, you won't have any construction around you, which would be awesome. So let's head on in, check it out. It's your entry. Look how tall your ceiling and your entryway will be. It's going to be amazing. Here on the right, your front room with a huge window. Look at all the natural light coming in. Once you get your walls up and uh, the window and just something to bounce the light around on, it's going to be really, really nice. I think you're going to really be pleased. Here is closet, front closet. Another closet and a front restroom. Looks like a powder bath. So there's the toilet area. Here is the sink. That's the black is your plumbing line. So your water will come out there. You see all up in there. <laughs> there's exhaust. So we'll head back to this way. Back to your front entry see up there they have your HVAC system in well, this room is your media room our office whatever whatever you want it to be Head through here here's another bathroom and that's excuse me not a bathroom this is your laundry room it's right off of your bathroom your master bath the closet, the master closet, how tall the ceilings are. You could have secondary storage really tall up there, um, like a seasonal storage. I'll head back out. This is your laundry room coming out through that. Cut across. There's one bedroom. Here's another bedroom. Again, gorgeous light coming in. And today is about 70 degrees. Tomorrow evening is supposed to get down to 17. <laughs> so the Texas weather is a little bit crazy, but I uh, wanted to get out today before it got too cold. Here's the guest bath off of the two guest bedrooms. And then, you know, all the blue lines are cold water, all the red lines are your hot. So anytime you see that, you know what that is. Here is your living and kitchen and your uh, eat-in kitchen area. Gorgeous. Look at all the windows. Love it. This is your, the stuff sticking out is your island. And then here is your kitchen. This blue line coming out is your water line to refrigerator. And this here is your pantry. And then that right there is the exhaust for the stove top. Um, then your gas line is gonna stub out down here where they said gas. So they haven't installed that yet, but it's coming. You have a little window seat. Gorgeous windows. And I love how tall these windows are. Here's looking back into the kitchen area. Looking amazing. Let's head outside just so you can see your yard. 
nice size yard, not, not huge, but not small, so you can definitely have some space to do something, but not too large to where you have to maintain too much. So good. Let's come in. I'm going to take you in your master bedroom. I'm ready for him to brick. That's going to be great too. Let's see here. So here comes into your master. Really cute bay window. Huge windows. Also a lot of natural light coming in. that I come along this is your master bathroom we cut through while ago from the laundry room to check it out but here it is here's your sinks you have two sinks with a window in between so you got a sink here and a sink there really cute window and on this side you'll have a tub on the right and your shower here on the left. And then here is a, a little toilet area. And then on the other side, it's like a little linen closet right there. And then we are back into our master closet. And then coming around to the laundry room where we were originally. And that's about it. Let's walk out to the garage. These guys are working. Looks like they're working on the gas line. All this black pipe is the gas. So the next time I come out, you'll have a gas line installed. One good thing to note is where everything is in the walls. So that, for example, on this wall, on that bedroom, you don't nail a picture into the wall through the black pipes. This is your main water line. So if you puncture that, the water <laughs> damage potential is there for sure. And then here is your upstairs attic. there she is she's looking amazing and uh, so excited to get out here they made so much progress in just a short few weeks but uh, can't wait for you to come out and check it out in person until then I'll be back out here and try to keep my eyes on everything for you if you have any questions let me know otherwise I will talk to you soon